The Fighting Saints women's basketball team have won nine consecutive games, and today, for the final time at home this regular season, they'll take the court one last time, taking on Indiana Northwest. Now Lodo Acosta with the shot clock running down, step back jumper on Triana Acosta gets the roll. Jordan Pyle backs in, Pyle out of a double team, finds the open Braxton Mickens, and Mickens lays it in. So she is on an individual 5-0 run here. Indiana Northwest has its biggest lead. And it's back down to three, thanks to the smooth jump shot of Andriana Acosta from the mid-range. Down the lane, kicks it outside, wide open top of the key. Kaitlin Sias Cheney knocks it down. Combined for 12 of their team's 17. Jordan Pyle backs in. Pyle throws one up with a right hand and scores without having scored. Braxton Mickens tries to end that drought, and she does. A three-pointer for Braxton Mickens. Jordan Pyle for three, and Pyle knocks it down. Here's Justine Charlesworth. The defense did not close in on her, and she makes him pay. Charlesworth with two three-pointers in the first half. This time, she lets Mickens try one, and Mickens knocks down the three. Now she starts to make her move to the right around the screen. She gets down low, looks into the corner, finds an open Braxton Mickens, and Mickens hits the three. Here's Anna Switek. Switek drives around Smolin, lays it up and in. Here's Justine Charlesworth for three. Got it. Timeout call by Indiana Northwest. Out of the corner, half Baker for three. That's no good. Rebound Jordan Pyle. And Indiana Northwest will not foul here. The Saints dribble out the clock, and it's gone final. 68 to 60. Our final score. St. Francis defeats Indiana Northwest. They avenge their loss from earlier this season. They do end the regular season with their 10th consecutive win, and they finish conference play with a record of 20-2 for the season.